today's video we're going to be doing only eating food and drink that I've never tried before um I thought I'd do this because I want to try like new things um so I hope you guys enjoy so for breakfast this morning oh I apologize for the light it's annoying um we're going to be having honey and um golden syrup porridge so um i've never tried porridge before so um wish me luck and then the milk i use then is obviously my lactose free whole milk um so we're gonna go and make some porridge and then after breakfast then obviously i'm just gonna quickly get ready and then we're gonna go to um starbucks and try one of their new drinks out is actually called um Sarah porridge um but i'm not sure if i like it or not it's um it's a hit and miss type thing um but yeah i don't know maybe it'll be like a little bit nicer if i put like actual um syrup in but it's not too bad to be honest i mean i wouldn't be able to eat like the whole bowl i might be able to eat like half but it wouldn't be like an everyday um breakfast type thing so that's my breakfast done now uh i'm just gonna quickly get ready and then you're gonna come with me then to starbucks to try one of the new drinks um, I don't know what I'm going to have today. I'm thinking like the white chocolate frappe maybe. Um, but we'll see when we get there now. So I've just been to Starbucks now and I picked up, um, well, I ordered the honeycomb um, hot chocolate. So I'm just going to take the tablets now and then we're going to give it a try. Sorry, there's so many people just staring at me. It's just really strange around my mum, yeah. But, um, plans for today is I've got to book, um, my car in it's playing up again but yeah surprisingly that's actually quite nice um oh yeah yeah really nice i could taste it now yeah But yeah, as I was saying, um, my mum's in work so she can't come along today, so I'm on my own. But I've got to book um, my car in. Um, I think like the power steering uh, liquid might be low or something. Um, and when I came out of isolation the other day, the horn kept going off. Um, so my uncle's kindly taken the horn fuse out. So I've just basically got to take it to the garage now 
and see if they can help me because I've been to a few garages this week and most of them are like it's an electrical problem um, we don't do electrical problems here um, it's like an MOT garage and my MOT is next month so I'll probably have to go half out or something but yeah I really do recommend the honeycomb um, hot chocolate especially in this weather I think maybe in the summer, if the honeycomb is still in, I might try the um, the frappe. But on a miserable day, I guess you um, you need it. Um, so yeah, so the next time you see me now, we'll, I'll be back in my house, and I'll be um, having dinner. I think it's a plant-based mac and cheese today. Um, So that is what I'll be um I'll be trying today. So for lunch today, I do apologize for my eyes a mess, I just took my car in the um the garage. Big massive um confidence boost for me. I usually go to my grandparents, but because of lockdown can't exactly go down there. So I thought, oh right, okay, it's time I try and conquer this fear of going to a garage all by myself. And I did it. I actually did it so anyways stop rambling on so anyways um for dinner we're going to be having the plant chef buttermilk casually mac tesco's helped me find this yesterday because i was looking for a, a vegan lasagna but they didn't have any so um they told me about this and they said basically this is like mac and cheese and to go with my mac and cheese we're going to be trying the uh, white grape, pear and apple juice. Now if you know me, I usually just have the purple grape juice and I'm not fast on pears. So we're going to give this a go because I've always wanted to try it. Um, so yeah, so we're just going to make my mac and cheese now and have my drink. Definitely tell the difference with the cheese. I'm not sure what the cheese they use in this, but I usually use like my free from block of cheese. But this cheese, it doesn't taste like my free from cheese. But it's not too bad. Like I wouldn't like buy it all the time if you get me. Like I, um. So yeah. But it isn't too bad, like, it's like, it's edible, like, but I don't think, like, I'd rush to, like, buy it. Mmm, now this is actually quite nice, as I said earlier i'm not fussed on pears um like i wouldn't like eat a pear i ate a pear before and i didn't like it but um the apple and pear and grape juice um 10 out of 10 recommend like i i really like this i i wouldn't have thought i would have as i said i don't like pears um but yeah i'll definitely be buying this and like my normal um purple um purple grape juice i usually buy um so yeah so we're gonna move on to dessert now which i think is fruit and i believe it's a water watermelon slices i've always wanted to try watermelon so let's give it a go so as i said we've got watermelon well they're called watermelon fingers 
but I would just call them watermelon slices. But anyways, we're gonna give them a go. I have a thing of eating my fruit with a fork. So eventually got a fork. Um, right, here goes. I'm nervous. Okay, I've discovered I don't like watermelon. It's vile. Um, I don't know how my mum can eat them, but she's gonna have them. No, 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 no. Absolute no. <coughs> no. Right, so for tea tonight, I'll be making um, cheese and potato pie. So what you need is obviously my lactose free cheese and some oh some potatoes um so all i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna peel my potatoes now and then i'm gonna boil them and then um yeah so yeah so i'm making cheese and potato pie i've never tried this in my life um obviously i've tried cottage pie and shepherd's pie and i like them um so we're gonna give this a go so yeah wish me luck Thank you. vitamins so um if you know me i usually have the purple and blue one i've never tried this one so we're gonna give this one a go Food list. Can't remember what they're called. Real fun. So this is a keeper. And vitamins. It's literally so nice. So I've got like 
three I like now, and at the moment these are on offer. In Tesco's with your club card for one pound fifty. Amazing. So yeah. So for dessert, we're gonna be trying the orange chalk uh, chip vegan cookies. Um, so these are from Morrison's. Um, apparently, I've been told they taste like club biscuits. So. Let's give it on the go. Mm. Oh my god, they do as well. Mm. Definitely buy you be buying more of these. So, anyways. That's the end of the video now. I'm just gonna munch. I'm just gonna finish munching on my cookies. Um. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um. I absolutely loved that cheese and potato pie. Mmm. It was amazing. So that's definitely staying on my meal plan. But anyways, that's the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more videos from me. Bye.